Today, February 19th, we celebrate the feast of St. Conrad of Piacenza. Born to one of the most noble and wealthy families in the town of Piacenza in northern Italy, Conrad grew up in a lifestyle marked by privilege and leisure. He married the daughter of a nobleman and, having married quite young, both he and his wife were recognised for their piety and charity. One day, while hunting, he ordered attendants to set fire to some brush in order to flush out the game. The fire spread to a nearby field and got to a large forest. Conrad fled. An innocent peasant was imprisoned, tortured to confess, and condemned to death. Conrad confessed his guilt, saved the man's life, and paid for the damaged property. Soon after this event, Conrad and his wife agreed to separate. She to a poor, poor Clare monastery and he to a group of hermits following the third order rule. His reputation for holiness, however, spread quickly since his many visitors destroyed his solitude, Conrad went to a more remote spot in Cilicia, where he lived 36 years as a hermit, praying for himself and for the rest of the world. Saint Conrad is especially invoked for the cure of hernia. This comes from miracles attributed to him. He was visited at his hermitage by a former friend and companion in arms. His friend was suffering from the pain of a hernia he had developed. Seeing the pain his old comrade was suffering, Conrad was moved to pity and prayed for him. He was immediately cured of the hernia. Conrad died while praying before a crucifix in 1350, surrounded by a bright light in the presence of his confessor, who was unaware for some time of his death because of his position. He was canonized in 1625. Saint Conrad of Piacenza, pray for us.